All right, welcome back. It's another month. It's February on my farm on Volcano Island. And we got some snow. So there's not going to be much I can uh, do. But you can only really plant sugarcane at this time of year anyway, so. And I don't have any inclination to be growing that. So I'm just going to take a little walk down and check my animals. Sheep look like they're probably fine. I guess they don't really care about snow. Once again, these pigs do not care. They're having a great time. Uh, they've got a little indoor bit as well. So they've got plenty of uh, warm places to, to hang about. Oh, this one's coming after the door. Get rid of that. We'll go have a look at the chickens as well. I've uh, just fired all my vehicles inside to protect them from the, the moisture. Didn't really have enough room, so I just fired this tractor in here. It's going to be tight squeeze. Oh god, no, can't get past that. I need to go on a diet, clearly. No, okay, so we've got lots of eggs. In fact, I forgot to check the wool. Yeah, you can see there's a couple of pallets of wool over there. I'll just let these build up a little bit more. And chickens seem to be fine as well. And I've got 179 chickens as well that have been near puberty. So I might just sell them. So we've got a lot of grain left. We can see the sheep have grass. Let's keep on top of that though because it is dipping. And the pigs have just grain. So my plan for the pigs is to plant some grain and some like soybeans for protein. And that should be all good. This is a mess. I wonder if that's going to affect my yield. Look at all these weeds. It does look nice though. I've got a little bit of silage here as well. I don't really know what I'm going to use that for. So there's not much I can do. I just need to leap through the winter. Try not to go bankrupt. Alright, so it's March. I think I've got more grass. It's ready to harvest. That's great. That means I can get on top of that. I definitely need grass as well because the sheep are looking a bit peckish. I think I'm going to have to purchase a bigger piece of land for, for grass, actually, if I'm going to need quite a bit of it. The good thing is I don't really have to do much of this, it just maintains itself. Yeah, I need to plant this bit because <laughs> my workers are getting confused what to do. Oh, I just destroyed what crops are. Right, so grab this tractor. I should be able to plant some crops up in the big field. So the best bet would be to plant sorghum, because that way I can use it for my chickens as well. And I can't do that right now, I have to wait. Yeah, I've got another month to wait. But I need that grass now, so I'm just going to cut the grass. I feel like I need a bigger lawnmower. This guy, even though he's fast, it takes so long. Right, while well, he cuts the grass, I'll load up some of these uh, eggs. Well, theoretically, I should be able to grab this one here, place it on top of the one behind it, and then lift them both. And the maneuverability is a little bit tougher now, actually. I'm not going to be able to get that in there, I don't think. No, no way. I'll just take these two at the moment. I'll bring the truck round. Yeah, I mean, it's a great map, but the placement for these things are not not filling me full of joy. Maybe I should just get a skid steer loader, because they are not as big. And it's probably built better for a skid steer. But it's okay. I'll get the eggs on. So according to this, the eggs should rise in price very soon. We're looking at about June, July. November seems to be the peak. And wool is actually... Apparently selling quite high at the moment. It is. I should have probably got the wool. Should make a nice profit off of this. Let's see how many of these I can stack. Yeah, I should be able to carry three of these, no problem. Can I do four? Yeah. What could go wrong? So if I could get them all in one. One for all. Tip it a little bit to me. There we go. Right, so ever so gently. Now, I don't know how I feel about turning with this. I'm just going to reverse my truck. Oh, let me go down, down, down. There we go. I can't foresee any problems with this. It doesn't even look like that top one's secured. But it is. So we want to take it to the clothing factory again. I know where that is. Yeah, this thing is uh, definitely wanting to topple. Imagine if you showed up uh, to like a supermarket or something with a delivery looking like this. Oh god, roundabout. Oh no, oh no, it isn't on, it isn't on. I mean, I'm impressed they got that far with it, to be honest. Ten grand. Well, I mean, that'll be a little bit more than that because 
this one here. I wonder if I can pick this up with my hands. That was too heavy. So this turned into a bit more of a long day than I had hoped. You know what? I'm just going to grab this other wool here. May as well just sell it all and get the profit while it's still high. Bro, can you not see what I'm doing here? What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, look at the situation you've caused. I swear to God, people are showing patient. No! Oh, it's not a dip. I didn't think it was going to be this problematic. Why is everything always, like, much harder than it seems? There we go. Dude! Just drove into me! The people of this village are really bad drivers. Okay, there we go. I'll fire this back up to the farm. Right, all. At least the delivery's done. This should send me over the 100 grand mark again. It's nice. There we go. Well, looks like the eggs have produced more eggs. So that's everything. I think it's all Wind Road. Have you Wind Road at all? I think he has. Oh shit, shit, my crops! Yeah, I've just done some damage there. Oopsie daisy. So I'm gonna plonk this down and grab that forge wagon because my sheep need some grass. That looks like a pretty good yield of grass. I do need to run over this with a, a cedar green and uh, maybe fertilize it and probably get me a better yield. So I will invest in a baler at some point. I don't know if I will use it on the grass. It just seems like an extra step to be honest. Oh, almost a full, uh, full load here. No, maybe not full, but about three quarters full. I'm pretty happy with that, to be honest, from a little field like this. I mean, the sheep take, what, 11,000 litres? So this is going to feed them for a while. And it costs me nothing. It just keeps growing, so. I'll fire this down to my sheep. I believe I just back it into here. And Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt. It must have been almost empty. Well, that should keep them going for a little while. Now, I know silage has got something to do with the uh, total mix ration of the cows. I just don't know what the whole freaking deal is with it in terms of how much you need of everything. But I don't have cows right now, I have pigs. I need to get my pigs some food and some straw. And right now I can't do anything because it's the wrong month. So I need to sleep and then I can go plant my crops. It's planting season for sorghum. Sorghum's very quick at growing. Now what did I do? Oh I think I left my planter up at the field didn't I? Let's hope no pikeys have been up there to steal it. Ah, it's not there. Probably ab absolutely ravaged from the the winter. I'm surprised if it works. Are you not planting my crops? I thought this thing just planted directly. Please plant my goddamn crops. Well, this is depressing. What a major pain in my ass. I am going to lease this. Five grand. I can eat that. That's fine. I hope it works. Oh my god, my my crops are so ugly. That is the worst planted field I've ever done in the history of farming sim. It looks like a fucking meadow. This should make my day a lot better. Oh my god, he just brake checked me. Did you see that? That guy actually brake checked me. And then he just walked off a direct hit from a tractor like it was nothing. Must be driving a Volvo. Right, so we can unfold this. There we go, that looks a bit more promising. I think I can probably just sell this now. Yeah, I mean, they can do the same thing, so... I may as well just sell that. There we go. Made a bit, a bit of money. Oh man, look at these eggs building up. Let's just check the price of eggs. They're going up. Yeah, we're still a little bit away from the top price, but we're getting there. Now, while my big cultivator does its job, I shall nip up there with a the weeder, because I don't want that big-ass field looking like the one we've got at the moment. I might sell that grass cutter as well at some point and buy a bigger one. Oh, he's missing half the fucking field. Why do they always make it look so hard? Go all the way down to the bottom. Bro, what the fuck? That car came in at light speed. Right, so they two should just work together and it should be all good. No weeds. I'm gonna have a little look at this uh, field actually. So there's a volcano. Yeah, it's a pretty, um, Pretty sizable field. Oh, and it started raining. And while they work at that, I shall load up my eggs. So I'm hoping the um the grains I've got for my chickens right now will last me until my sorghum crops grow because it only takes a couple of months to grow the sorghum, which is quite handy. 
Problem is, you've got nothing for the rest of the year. Oh my god. That was close. Well, there's not much I can do now. I just have to wait. But when I look at my field, so I need rolled. I've turned off lime because liming is just boring. The yield bonus is 73%. It's 50% fertilised already. I wonder if that's because it had a root crop in it beforehand and it's sort of fertilised it with the, the sort of the leftover bits. I could be talking shite though. I don't know. Alright, so that's the field seeded. Hold this up and take it back. I'm going to hold on to this because it's much better than the uh, other one I had. I wonder if there's a reason so many farm, much of farm equipment is like red and yellow. Is it just because it's easy to see? High vis and all that. Health and safety. I need a roller. Damn, I didn't expect it to be that expensive. Because I kind of need it. I want to get as much yield on my crops as possible. Um, I think the small tractor can pull the fertilizer. So that's okay. The good thing is the rollers are about 12 meters. This is a small one and it's like 12.3 meters or something. So it shouldn't take long to roll a field. I forgot I have that corn header as well. I might sell that because I don't know if I'll ever bother getting corn. I'll, I'll hang on to it for now just in case I decide to. Now I feel like this shouldn't take long. That's quite satisfying. You know what? I think I might just do this myself. I think the AI is just going to make a massive mess of this. Because it's so visually easy to see, see where it's sort of been rolled already. I <laughs> cannot reverse worth the shit. Oh god. I don't know why it takes so much horsepower to drag this thing. It's not really that complicated, but I guess it is heavy. So I'm just going to go around the edges of the field. I think this is a much more efficient way than letting the AI do it, because the AI would go up and down the field and it just takes forever. But once I've done the awkward bits, I'll probably let my AI take over. Ah oh, shit, my weeder is coming this way. Nope, nope, what are you doing? Please don't do that. Right, so it's these corners that are a bit of a pain to get right into. Could you imagine uh, having to manoeuvre the massive roller? I think with two passes the field will be finished. This is the last little bit. Then I just need to fertilise it. Right, so. Take the roller back. Kind of run out of space to store things. Um, I guess I'll just stick this in my garage. There we go. Oh crap, I don't know where to put this either. I don't think I need that cultivator anymore, actually. So I might sell that. I actually don't like this fertilizer. I like the smaller compact one, to be honest. Um, so I might sell that as well. Yeah, I prefer this one. It does just as good a job. So I'll buy that, and I will sell the one I've got. And this one covers a huge width. You can see they're 42 meters. Yeah, it's massive. It's more compact. It's cheaper. The only thing it doesn't do is lime, but I've turned liming off. Because who wants to fertilize and lime? It's just, you know, there's a level of simulation that isn't fun. Right, so it's a new month. My crops are growing. And I can fertilize them now. And that should give me, there we go, 98%, 95 And I'll just sort of go around fertilizer my whole field. Wasting a load of fertilizer as well. As you can see my money plummet from it. And we have more grass ready to harvest. I'm actually going to have a look at the moors. See if I can get a bigger one. I'll purchase that and I shall sell the other one. It's quite nice having um, this new machinery. Making everything a lot more faster and that's what farming's all about I guess. Just trying to make everything more efficient. So this is much bigger. This should only take a couple of uh, passes on the grass. Fantastic. The good thing is AI workers don't damage your crops when you drive over them. Oh yeah, I was going to sell that cultivator, wasn't I? It's another 17 grand in the back. Uh, I would like to upgrade this wind at some point as well, but... Um, yeah, this will do for now. Once I get a bigger field, maybe. I uh, look how quick he was to cut all that grass. So I could probably get a bigger bit of uh, land for the grass. Yeah, at this rate I'm probably going to end up with a surplus of grass. Because the sheep don't actually eat that much. Right, so our sheep's grass has went down a little bit. So I'll replace that. And I feel like the pigs are probably just, uh, got nothing. Yeah, I mean they've still got grain. The grain seems to be lasting them. My main mission right now is just to get this grass down to the pigs. 
not the pigs, the sheep. And then skip to tomorrow and harvest my barley or wheat or whatever the hell it is. Yeah, there we go, it's filled. Surplus grass is not a bad thing. I am thinking about just selling the pigs though. Yeah, so they only use 40% of my trailer there. Alright, well that'll be another day over. Right, so finally I should have crops ready to harvest. Which means I can bring this bad boy out. And I can see them over there. Now, I believe these ones produce straw, which we do need for the pigs. Right, so we want to lower and turn it on. Oh, I have missed so much of this field. Oh my god. Um, I guess I'm just doing this myself then. Because the AI won't go in the direction I want them to. Now there's great demand at the stand, um, which I believe is eggs. So, I want my eggs down there. Hoping the AI will go in the direction I want them to now. Please go straight. No! Stop it. Yeah, the AI is just trolling the shit out of me here. Ah, whatever, I'll come back and do the rest of it myself later. It's only going to be a little bit that he's going to miss. Alright, so we've got some straw. And we got loads of wool. And I have no idea what I'm going to do with this uh, grass. So much to do now. Yeah, so the chickens are not producing eggs anymore because they are not got any grain. Oh my god. Doesn't really matter if they're on there neatly or not. We just want them on. So I'll get these down to the stand. Should make a tidy amount of money from this. I think I know what way I'm going now. Damn, these guys, they just break check you everywhere. So if I believe we go to the left this way. No, this is not the correct way. God damn it. Oh, my sense of direction in this game is terrible. So it's right at the roundabout, not left. You didn't remember that for uh, future reference. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm in a rush to get eggs to the people. I think it's just, it's on this road, is it? Yep. Oh no. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I have the world's hardiest eggs. I need a jackhammer to crack one of these open. Oh, yeah, I forgot how terrible the brakes are. Wow, almost 50 grand on eggs. I think it was well, closer to 50, uh, 45. Well, the animals are definitely profitable. I've got all that wool sitting there as well. Problem is, I'm not producing anything because of the, um, the grain situation. The pigs, I think, are, are probably... Oh, damn. People see you in the rear view mirror here and just instantly slam their brakes on. So yeah, the um, pigs, I think I'll just breed one round of pigs and just sell them all and then get cows instead. I don't really see the point of having the pigs if you're just selling them for meat. I prefer just having the byproducts and selling byproducts. So I'll give my grass a little bit of a fertilise just to improve the, the yield, I guess. Can you fertilise it? Yeah, you can. This worker has made a mess of my field. What the hell is this? Yeah, the yield on this looks pretty terrible. I mean, the chickens are making me quite a lot of money, but at the same time, more of a pain in the ass to feed than the sheep, because sheep literally just need grass, and that's super easy. I don't know why he stopped here. Like, clearly I want this bit done as well. Why would you just stop? I don't understand. Wool is selling quite well, actually. So I think the last thing I'm going to do today is just lift these pallets, because there's loads of them. You gotta be so gentle turning and go so wrong. That top one can just fly off. So I'm definitely not doing it four high because the last time I did that, that was crazy. And uh, not secure in the slightest. Yeah, should we get, we'll get the um, three loads of pallets in there. Whoa. And we know we can do three high. Oh shit! Oh, that actually might work out for me. That's fine. I reckon we can probably just slap this on top. Right, so that's that secured. I'll take these off to the... I can't remember what you call it. So my <laughs> truck is 91% uh, capacity. So another uh, fill crate probably wouldn't have been possible. This is really shaky. You can kind of see 
that the truck is swaying from side to side. That's not good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. That's not good. <laughs> right, here we go. Oh, it's starting to slide off. I'll do it. 22 grand, so the, the chickens are still more profitable. Oh, I have a full grain tank, so I better go pick up my trailer. Man, there's a lot, a lot getting done today, in the month of June. I'll just be glad I can replant those fields because they were a real state. Let's get collecting. So I can't remember this wheat or barley. Yeah, I honestly might just sell the pigs. It's not like I'm actually enjoying having them, they're not. They're just too much work for me. I'm gonna sell all of you. Sorry, piggies. I'm gonna buy some cows. Now, I want the milk ones. So this breed's used for dairy farming. So these two are dairy farming. Angus is generally beef, I would imagine. Because we have Aberdeen Angus burgers in Scotland. They're very expensive. I'll get them younger. I can raise them and then they'll start um, producing. So they need grass, hay and TMR. So I don't really need straw then. So if I go for these ones, how can you get them at zero months old? Do they produce milk at 12 months? They must do. Schubert is 18 months. So I, maybe they don't produce milk until 18 months. Which is going to cost me a hundred grand. I am going to get these ones. No, oh, that's too much. I can't spend that much money. What I'm going to do is I'm going to buy the full size ones. I'm going to get 12 of them. Hey, Daisy. Right, so if I have a look here, they do have straw. They produce milk and slurry. And so I can feed them grass as well. So if I just feed them TMR, that gives me 100% effectiveness. I just need to figure out how TMR works. Right, I'll leave that there. Um, and I shall tackle my cows in the next video. Right, thanks for watching and I'll see you then.